Hello everybody, this is Big Daddy Rocker Gamer, and this is a new episode of uh, Phoenix Point. Today is a historical day as the Manticore Team A and uh, the Helios 2 Team B is teaming up for a for a uh, joint battle on a Pandoran lair. I've been wondering who I should bring for this, and... Uh, I think I'm going to strip Phoebes here of her gear and take Phoebes out and bring in Polina because of the friend judgment head here. I think that is the play and I'm also considering bringing Santiago here uh, because of his uh, Deceptor. And I think this is the squad. I don't think there's anything else I can do except spray and pray and hope I don't die. Lairs have in general been my biggest problem whenever I've been playing this game. Citadels are easier because you can see the Scyllas from miles away. Hat, uh, nests are easy enough because they're small scale. You just drop in and you basically have simpler enemies to deal with. Lairs gives you Chirons and Sirens and loads and loads of Arthrons and uh, Tritons. And you still have to deal with something that has over 3,000 health and 60, 50, 60 armor. And then you have to evacuate on top of it all. So, yeah. Lairs are generally the biggest problem. So let's see how this works out. Right, let's see what we're dealing with. So the game just blocks us off immediately. Okay, that's good to know. So, by all likelihood, the lair is here or here. The nest, I mean. And... I think I'm going up here using instill frenzy. I see them. Enemy spotted. If I, however, just don't play by their rules, I just get over here and I run this way. I'm going to take the scenic route through here. We... And there it is. There's the spawn array. Can I take it down from here? Does any of my guys have the range for that? None of them have the range for it, of course. I think the best option is to fight my way up and then use this exit here. But I'm going to need to stay together as a group. I'm going to need to kill everything that comes my way as soon as it comes my way. And in general, I think this is the way to go about this. Uh, maintain. 
jumping in. As little contact with the enemy as possible. Blow them up when I find them. When they when they're dumb enough to cross me. Moving in quick. And generally just stay out of enemy sight. I think that's the only play I have. And move together as a unit. Don't use any willpower unless I have to. Catch me if you can. Moving in quick. Uh, I'm a little bit worried for Polina here because I think she's going to be targeted. But we'll see. Triton comes in and he's alerted. Of course he's alerted. Who else is alerted? That guy, obviously. I do have a couple of grenade launchers. I could maybe double lob some grenades here and uh, take out these tritons. While I try to get my... Don't kill her! Don't you dare kill her! She's done nothing to you. And I wish that to remain the case. Okay. I'm running up Santiago. That's 
Good shot. Oh, that's a really good shot. Well done. And now... I am opening the way. <laughs> and she's coming down here. Setting up Leva here, and I'm gonna have her deploy her shield like this. This is okay. I can live with this. It's not the worst that could happen. Taking the scenic route, I don't exactly dig it. Oh, really? Infected by virus. I can have uh, Levo go down and kill that guy. How much health do you have? 230. goes back. Victor goes up and he just finishes it off. Or not. That works too. That was not exactly what I had in mind, but sure. He should be dead. <sighs> Watch this. That's a waste of time. If I go up like this. Let's go. Have Emiliano meet up with my team there.
and then we get rid of this Arthron. Perfect. Uh, I'm not sure what to do about this because. Okay, lean forward again. There we go. And now he takes willpower and he messes about. And I move out here. Now, this is as much as I can do. That guy bleeds out, that's perfect. And from here on, I need to just beeline up. Kill whatever comes in behind me from this entrance. Ow, frack. That's not nice. Tritons and Arthrons. Now, he is hanging around up here, and he's going to just do this. Uh, he doesn't care. Yeah. Moving. Now, Victor also has this option. And he's gonna do that. 60 bleed and the enemy has... Nothing to show for it. Instill Frenzy hits everyone, so that's great. We're gonna instill Frenzy. And I'm gonna run her up here. That's great. Sophia down here. Actually, I'm going to run Sophia here, I think. A quick aim. Uh, let's see, can I take out this Arthron? I can. Perfect. You are gonna go up here and uh, make you feel heal up. Uh, well, let's make this happen. You have no arms, so Leva is just gonna go up here and take you down, take you out of my misery before continuing upwards. Perfect. And I'm gonna make this rocket jump here because I wanna move up as fast as possible. And uh, this is the only real way I have of dealing with this. Just keep moving and move fast. Now, what's going on here? Arthron ends its turn there, that's okay. He's gonna be a coming for me. I, ha I cannot see any Chirons yet. And I like that. 
That's actually very, very heartening. In my sights. And that allows the rest of my team to just run forward. Far enough. No, I can't. Okay. That means you just keep on running. Enemy spotted. What did you spot? Not this one. Not this one. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What? Oh, crap. There's your Chiron. Okay. So. I need to get everyone up into position here. Because if I'm going to deal with the Chiron, I'm going to need a whole damn team up here with me. And I prefer it if the Chiron would be completely clueless as to my whereabouts. And I'll run up now while I still have Frenzy active, because... Let's face it, it's gonna be hard when... Or much slower once the Frenzy runs out. I'm gonna try something funny. How... I'm gonna do this. It's just a single shot, but it's... 30 armor break. <laughs> it's a bit cheesy. Oh man, I'm gonna... I'm gonna do that. I think that's the play here. And Sophia, you just have to run. Run and run and run and run and never look back. Now, let's see what this Chiron does and how annoying it's going to be. Uh, I do need to deal with that as quickly as possible, I think. Because if I don't deal with it, it's going to keep on blowing me up. And this Arthron is one round away from me. The Triton is annoying, but I can survive, I think, maybe. Ish. Ow! Ow, 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 ow. Don't, don't, don't go killing her. Alright. So. We start with this. Guess it's my turn, Daddy. I'm wondering if I kill this Chiron. 40 armor, 20 armor. Launches poison worms. 
If I destroy this... Can he launch poison worms long enough? No, he cannot. Oh, would you look at that? We're just gonna do this. Keep on taking away all the armor. Probably should use the shredder instead. Like the deceptor here. Oh, yeah, I have poison worms to deal with. That's okay. I can deal with them. There is, as far as I'm aware, no other poison worms here. I'm just gonna run up here. Induce panic. And I'm gonna run you up here, I think. Yeah, this is this is the current play. Next round. I am going to recover some Come on, don't be that Let's continue launching on the spawnery here. 61 damage, that's nice. And... I'm thinking, I'm only gonna have this... One shot here. Keep on bleeding it. I'm repositioning. Well, let's make this happen. Actually, we'll just move up here. And this guy, gonna keep on shredding. How does that thing? That guy's panicked, that guy's so far away. So we're just gonna keep on shooting at it. And now, if I do this, or well, you know what? I'm gonna recover to will points. That guy really wants to get up close and personal, and that's okay. He is now... You should be panicked, mister. It's okay. You're allowed to be an ass. This Chiron is going to be a problem. As long, but as long as it keeps on knocking its worms all over. Okay, let's deal with things. Let's 
start with Victor here. Victor can, of course. Yeah. Just go. Boom. Uh, I can, of course, do this because I need to reserve a little bit of a. Are you joking me? That should just not ever happen. Takes care of that. And... So we finally got a little bit of bleed here. Hostile wounded. Resisted. Of course it resists. That's okay. This Chiron is going to keep on throwing worms at me. And I'm going to need to dedicate resources to take out these worms. Every single flipping round. Everything else is luckily very far away, so it's not a big danger. When I say big, doesn't mean it's not a danger, it's just not. Leva is now on poison worm duty. Please don't miss. That was a Good kill. job. And uh, Polina is also on poison worm duty. And for some reason, that's just never enough to kill it, is it? That's really frustrating. That guy. So, what I'm gonna do here. I'm 
How do I do this? And just have him take pot shots. And I do this with this guy. That's actually decent damage. Now targeting. She is taking on this and then gotcha. she's taking that. He's bringing his deceptor up. And we're eating away at whatever it has left of armor. Proceeding. That guy is so far away, it's pointless to resist. Until it gets closer. This is how we do it. Extremely slowly, extremely steady, praying that that one sniper doesn't somehow manage that lucky shot that kills me in one go. Like that. That's bullshit. And now, I have a lot of people who are... Ah, oh, that's great. Only a single worm this time. But now, I'm going to use both my Grenadiers up close to see if I can kill or at least cripple that Chiron. And I'm going to use Sophia to aim for that guy. So, let's see here. I go up here. I'm gonna start taking this guy. And I'm just gonna boom it. Like this. Oh, would you look at that? It's a lot of damage. I'm going to move Santiago up here. Ah, uh, Santiago go. Take it on as well. Now, this little thing needs to die. And of course it doesn't, so why? Because why would it? And this guy... Should die. I'm gonna have Paulina up here to deal with the worm. Hopefully she can hit it at least once. It's dead. Okay, that's perfect. And this guy just keeps on whacking at the spawner. I can set up another grenade on the Kyra. I think that's a smart thing to do. I should hit though. Leva. I'm gonna set Leva up here. I'm gonna have her deploy the shield. In this direction. I want to deal with this guy. Acquiring target. 
Taking position. Taking aim. We do this, and it hits. We have a disabled Chiron. And maybe that's enough to bleed out the Pandora, the Tritoff. I think it was. The Chiron is panicking. This is good. And uh, one worm. This guy down here keeps hitting from downtown. And that's very, very frustrating. This guy is not dead, okay. But a grenade would solve that. Oh god, no, 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 no. Okay. New threat has arrived. Need an angle. That was Polina does what Polina does. And Victor. You are going to lob some maids here and take out this siren. There you go. Take out the siren's cover too, if you would. And, uh, crap. This is not making me feel happy. They keep hitting me from downtown. to need a grenade again. At least I'm t shredding away some armor here. If I do this, I run in and That sounds very risky. Here. Five by five. Keep on hitting. You have to hit. Taking aim. Bleed. That's good. Good. Leva. Could I? Pushing on. This is a gamble. It's a big ass gamble. But we're doing some. Gotta keep going. Siren abusement here. Now, this siren has just enough health to survive. 
taking aim. That should take care of it, though. If I put on my careful aiming here. And continue doing this. Siren should be dead. And that panics the Chiron. That's perfect. That's actually perfect. How many other things are panicked? Oh, perfect. Now, that thing, that thing. Okay. This might be the time when I position myself here. And throw in some basic hearts. Got you good. Let's see now. And I'm going to just continue working on this Chiron with my grenades because I don't want this thing to. Ever uh, be a hindrance when I'm trying to escape. Okay, Victor has to move a little bit. It's okay, Victor has full health and he has lots of armor. He can move. I'm going to continue grenading. And that misses. I'm gonna recover. And it's down, it's down, it's down. Tyrant. Let's you have Arthur and Gun. And you have a shield up, okay. Move here, do you have better aim? You do. Gotcha. Nice. Moving to coordinates. I don't want to move backwards with this guy. Ow. How badly was I? Okay, not that bad. Wasn't that bad, actually. Yes. All right. Titan Poacher. All right. Instilled Frenzy. I don't have enough for that. So let's start with the evacuation protocol here. Leva, hit. And then you run. I 
and you run. Not that far away. What do you have available to aim at? Ah, some Just get up here. And you are gonna go up here. Perfect. And you are going to do the same. Perfect. Perfect. And she's my high priority soldier, so she has to move. She cannot stay behind. I think this this might be successful. Shield bearer, that's okay. I can lower the shield bearer. That triton though. Oh, is that one of those? No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. How's Leva? How's Leva the way? Okay, leave, leave us alive, leave us alive, okay. Leva has a very long way to run. I'm gonna go here. And I'm gonna take out that thing. Right there. And now we're setting him up here. This is great. I'm ready. This thing, what we should do here, is to set it up like this. Overwatching. Man, if I set her up to recover. I'm repositioning. And like this. Let them come. Victor. And see if I can do some harm to that thing. Oh, great. That's actually fantastic. And we set Victor up here. Aim. I'm doing that just because I can, no other reason. I'm um, setting everyone up on our overwatch because my next plan is to use uh, 
my priest who's not Phoebes. Polina. To instill frenzy. So everyone has a truck ton more of movement. And then I'm gonna try to get everyone out. Leva, I'm running up here. And I'm setting up the shield. And she's stopping there. Amina, she's running up here. Emiliano, can he reach this? Probably couldn't even if you wanted to. It's all right. Victor has more range now. Let's see. Can Victor do nothing? So Victor should keep on running. Keep on running in the free world. Instill frenzy really is an amazing uh, buff. I'm gonna have him up top there. And finally, my priority sniper getting out of there. Out of action points, let's see. Chiton is down. Let's see what happens. Ho 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 ho! That's actually amazing. I was much better than I expected it to be. Now. I'm gonna send Victor up here. Do I have... Can he go around? Yeah, he can, but it takes a lot of movement. Okay. I'm gonna send Victor up in the corner here. Next round, hopefully everyone will be able to buckle up. You have enough for a rocket jump, you have enough for a rocket jump. So I'm just setting you guys up to I'm just setting you guys up to slow down this Arthron. In any way possible. And just make sure it suffers. Moving. If it's trying to make a name for me. Now. Clear. I'm gonna bring Sophia up here. Next time Sophia, all she needs to do is just drop down. Let's see. Yeah, I didn't expect that. You never know. Now, Amina is getting up top here. I just want everyone as close to the exit so that they can all evacuate next time. I might have to wait another round. If only to make sure that Polina also makes it out.
Why do the handguns have such massive range? I think Polina is going to need at least one more round. That's unfortunate, but it is what it is. I don't think there's anything threatening me at this point. So I can live with that. Okay, at least you didn't hit any of your own. That's good, Paul. Leave it. Um, Paulina might even need yet one more round. Yeah, just keep on. These guys will rocket jump out, so they're okay. This guy should be dead now. And that he is. Joanna is getting up. I'm here. Now I'm gonna move Joanna up here. And before I evacuate anyone, I'm just gonna make sure that Polina can actually get out. Welcome to the squad, Polina. This was a crazy mission to succeed. And with no casualty, no less. I think it was dumb luck, nothing else. Because it certainly wasn't skills. Moving to coordinates. Oh man. Wow. Everyone is out. Everyone is still alive. Everyone's hurt. But the lair is done. Hmm. I'm disappointed by the amount of experience. I would at least thought that Polina would get a little bit more, considering she was instrumental in. in this strategy. Well, this is a pretty long episode. Uh, just this uh, right here. I'm not sure how much setup I'm gonna do now, or if I'm gonna do any setup at all before ending the episode. Now, nah. I'm gonna do a little bit, a little bit. Uh, I now plan to go back to hitting up some of the story missions. I really need some of them. Uh, Pandora and Lair destroyed. Yes. Sinitrian, apostles of a false creed. Humans at the top of creation. Lies. We are not evolved, not yet. Find their homes. Break their heathen beliefs. Show them the wrath of the dead god. Blood. Blood. Fire. Fire. In, In the, the streets. streets. Yes. Ah, I suppose I have to. Yes. Our command, your action. The minds that move. move, the hand that strikes. 
I cannot replenish any of the resources that I used, and I used a lot of resources. Because I have literally no materials. Uh, that said, I'm just gonna head over here and trade. Nope, I'm not gonna trade. Trade. Phoenix Project Resources. None of you guys want food? Wait, wait. Let's see. None of you guys want food. So let's see. The Helios 2. Uh, we're gonna just move it up into the base here. And I'm gonna move up the Manticore as well. And we'll see what happens. Amphion leg armor. Cool. So I'm gonna go into the, my personnel here and uh, go to Phoebes because Phoebes is the one without armor now. Not anymore. She has armor now. And, uh, yeah. I really don't want to deal with this corruption. It's annoying. But it takes a lot of resources to get rid of. I cannot continue doing that because I don't have enough mutagen. That's frustrating. Now, the Matok is something I've been putting off for a very long time. The experiment continues. I haven't put on that long, but it's still something that I should do. Catacombs of Despair. Uh, I should have started on this a long time ago, I think. But that said, I think for now I'm going to stop it here and uh, figure out what my next step is. This is Big Dad, Daddy Rocker Gamer, and this has been Phoenix Point taking down a lair. It's been a pleasure. See you next time.